All right, check out our new sponsor, Greenwood Stocks. They want you to know how to be able to trade stocks and be your own boss and be free to travel the world by making passive income. We all need that passive income from stock market. What are you waiting for? Call and text 281-760-3170. If you didn't catch that, that's on your screen. Or check them out at social media, Greenwood Stocks, and catch them at Gmail, Greenwood Stock Trading at Gmail, and the YouTube channel is Greenwood Stocks. Appreciate them for giving me the opportunity. Check them out. We out. All right, man, let's talk about... Uh, Chris Webber and also Marv Albert may not return to TNT and TNT could be shaking up their broadcast crew um, But let's get to it. Appreciate everybody for tapping in. Check out the NBA talk playlist and the music entertainment playlist uh, Appreciate the love and support man. And um, this article I read from New York Post, but you got Spun, you got uh, Black Sports Online, you got Clutch, you got Uprox I wrote from New York Post. It says that Chris Webber could be out uh at TNT after madness and frustration. Um, let's get to it. I do appreciate everybody for tapping in. Best way to donate the channel. Thumbs up. Share the video with somebody you know. Uh, word of mouth the best way. Also, if you want to financially support the channel, I just share the video for me. But my cash app is in the description. CJ Good doing three PayPal link there as well too. TNT could have a completely new look with this top broadcast team next year. The posts have learned. While Marv Albert, Marv Albert, legendary career maybe con concluded after he does Eastern Conference Final sources. Uh, said that Chris Webber's return uh, next year is also very much a question. No retirement decision yet has been made by Albert, arguably the greatest NBA play-by-play -play of all time, on whether he will try to continue to continue his career after the season. Albert, who turns 80 and June, is still doing it at a high level, um, has also worked NBA games for nearly six decades. He, he is in the final season of a five-year deal he signed when he was 75. In February, Albert told the Post, his career was winding down. Still nothing official yet. Weber has been on TNT's number one team for a few seasons, but yet to fully connect with the audience, the feeling that Weber may not return has been building for a while. In March, Weber did not help himself, even wishes to continue to call games by former turn officials very late that he would not do the NCAA tournament that took place in the bubble format in Indianapolis. Though TNT has been un very understanding about the COVID concerns throughout the pandemic, the fact that Weber waited until the last moments before billing was looked up as poor form. When CBS Turner had their press conference uh, to preview the tournament, it did not have the announcement of the broadcast team as it customarily did in the years past. This was not a big deal, but the reason was because of Weber's indecision. Reggie Miller also participated in the tournament. However, he and his wife just had a baby boy. Damn, Reggie had a baby boy. How old is Reggie Miller? That's one of my favorite players. I went in middle, in middle school, in elementary school, in the league. I wore 31. Damn, Reggie still having Reggie got to be about 50. Sheesh. Even people like me, I started without biological kids. Hope. Shit, Reggie getting it in, excuse me. At 35 years, at 55 years old? Jesus. Well, his, his, his first wife, let me see what his second wife is. Jeez. Jesus, he, get, he still getting it in. Yeah, he only got one wife. So they ended their marriage in 2001. Uh, but I don't know whoever his new wife or girlfriend is. They don't got to post it. Miller informed the network ahead of time about, you know, the baby. Weber absence led, led to uh, Grand Hill emergence during the opening two rounds of the NCAA working with Ann Eagle. Hill sounded like a different analyst in two months in the booth. Hill contract, like Weber's and Aunt Albert's, is up at the end of the season. Besides Miller, TNT also has Jim Jackson as analyst. Paul Pierce recently fired by ESPN after the post of the Ransom Instagram video. He did it on purpose. People stupid not to, not to believe, not to know it. It's a free agent, Richard Jefferson. This is his last season of an ABC ESPN contract. Albert, uh, if Albert does retire, Turner has Eagle, uh, has Eagle, Kevin Harlem, Brian Anderson as play-by-play -play players on the staff. At one point, Anderson had the inside track to replace Albert. Uh, that's was seen as the former head of Turner, David Levi's preference. Anderson has also uh, been with Turner and led. MLB play by play. Now it is more wide open. Turner may prefer not to declare anyone new number one and go with a close a closer by committee approach. The difference between number one team and the others is doing the All Star game as well as the conference finals. It would lose a little bit if Turner went that route. 
Um, though Albert is not the pinnacle in the booth, he has uh, he is the best to ever do it. His retirement is possible, although nothing is official yet. The ESPN radio show, Keyshawn, uh, Will, J. Will, and, and Zubin have been without their point guard for a while. Zubin has been dealing with complications related to recent diabetes diagnosed that have kept him out. Who is Zubin? Let me see who Zubin cat is. That should be on early, so I don't really never catch it. Okay, okay. I see him. He's a little funny guy. Okay. Let's keep going. In his place, Alan Hahn has been very good moving the conversation and offering opinions with Keyshawn and Jason J. Williams. Meanwhile, in the middays, Bar Scott has picked up the same groove we left off with Chris Carlin. The two worked smoothly together dating back to their run with WFAN. So, I mean, like I said before, a lot of people say Chris Webber ain't good. If you don't believe me, let's type Chris Weber ENT into Twitter and I will read you know, and Chris Weber from the you know from Detroit like me. But he ain't very good, they say. Um Okay. It's really about him. Uh see they ain't got no pants, it's just about him basically being his last run. Alright, we can just go into the comment section of one of them. Shout out to NBA Central, they do a great job. Uh, he needs to stay retired and stay away from the microphone. I can't wait till this is official. We smoking on Chris Webber pack when he leaves. ESPN needs to fire Rachel Nichols. Okay. Uh, Doris Burke can't stand hearing her call. I love Doris Burke. He hates her. Chris seems like a great dude and I wish him nothing but the best. I would be ecstatic if he, if I never have to listen to him again, call the game again. The people behind NBA, okay, okay, who cares? He should have never been hired. We can only hope he goes, but there's no reason to wait until the end of the season. Great player, terrible announcer. Please let this happen. He ruins the games. He's impossible to listen to. Somebody says replacement. Hold on. I don't know who that kid is. Some kid. Some dude. He don't be talking about ish. But they're going to keep Shaq awful takes. Somebody was in his favor. Uh, so. The other, the other announcers stay talking over him. Who cares? Everybody in there or Chuck, Shaq, Ernie, and Smith, especially Chuck and Shaq. Yeah, my whole thing is. uh, I, I don't even, you know, I don't really care about the presentation. So much, you know, what, what really. What really irks my nerves with um it's 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 the game. The game is what uh what really irks my nerves. The game ain't nothing but three point shooting, no defense, touch fouls, free throws. Basketball has come. It's the one of the it's the one of the worst sports that I've seen. Only reason in, in NHL and I watch during the playoff time when they have the winter the winter thing outside. Only reason NFL dropping NHL dropping favors because of the lockout. That was the biggest mistake. Or from a pure game standpoint, NHL is probably one of the better ones. NFL, they kind of falling off a bit because of the rule changes and they don't want to pay nobody lifetime benefits. But NBA is by far one of the worst sports that I feel. One thing I, I, I respect about the traditional sports, I love going to NASCAR when I can. But NASCAR, golf, played it. Um, uh, tennis, I love women's tennis. Men's tennis, not too many Americans no more. Is they they stay the same as traditional? You know what I'm saying? With the NBA, they change the rules and superstar calls. To me, it's just art of trash. You know, people want to talk about people want to talk about uh people want to talk about uh excuse me, Chris Webber. But the game is it's the game is trash. More tr the game is worse than Chris Webber commentary. Straight up and down. It is. It's a terrible game. It's terrible. It's garbage. It's trash. And to be honest, I don't want to watch it no more. And on top of that, you got super teams, so it's no longer competitive, you know. But uh, which Chris Webber the best? I know ill will towards him. But people talking about this commentary. How about before we get rid of Chris Webber or chastise or criticize Chris Webber? How about you criticize the game? Touch fouls, fifty free throws, super team. The NBA is the worst. I can't watch it no more. I try to watch it in the playoffs. Try to watch it when I can. I can't watch it no more. 
I'd rather watch Invincible over and over again. Cobra Kai. I'd rather just be on the computer watching YouTube. Straight up and down. But uh, check out the music entertainment playlist. Check out the NBA Talk playlist. More videos like this. Let me know what you guys think about Chris Webber, Marvin Abbott, probably in the booth. Um, other than that, you can reach me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. All my social media links in the description. Um, just hit me up. You know, if you got a video request, want to advertise your business on the channel, work with a few uh, business owners, uh, hit me up. Um, check out the uh, the Facebook group. That link's there as well, too. Want to make a financial donation? All that's in the, in the description. Cash app, CJGood313. PayPal link in the description. Best way to donate, share, share the video. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Peace.